Hey guys, it is uh, Saturday, July 1st, and Top Step is about to come out with some sort of promotion. You, looking at the image, it's probably going to be simplifying into one step instead of step one, step two, then funded. Now, of course, if you've been funded before like me, you're already a one, in a one-step process. Um, so as you know, uh, I'm an attorney. Uh, I don't really want to be an attorney, but lo and behold, here I am. I want a day trade. Uh, if I had to take a wild guess, a couple of things using my business hat and my attorney hat. Okay. Um, they do publish that their pass rates are 22%. Okay. If I were looking at that from a regulatory and from a legal perspective, I wouldn't like that 22% a lot. I'd be like, damn, only 22% of your people actually can, you're telling people that they can make money, but only 22% are actually making money. I'd probably want to, you know, make I'd be kind of concerned with that if I were a regulator. Uh, from a business standpoint, other companies are making it easier to get funded, which is what most of you gambling degenerates care about. Of course, it's what I care about as well. Uh, either way, here's, here's the thing that you need to know. You must become a skilled day trader no matter what company that you're using, no matter what, if you're trading your own money. The only reason that I'm not trading my own money is because I lost it. It's not because I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to tell you. I didn't care about. I thought I was confident. I thought I was confident. I thought I knew what I was doing way before, and I still don't, you know, have a full understanding of what I'm doing. These markets are difficult. Like I don't know what to tell you, folks. There's a reason why historically this has been a loss leader industry. It's been a 90, 90, 90 industry. 90% of people. Uh, yeah, I'm one of the 90%. Hello, welcome. 90% here. That being said, uh, it doesn't matter what funding company you're using, whether it's Top Step or Apex. I personally prefer Top Step now because, as you know, I'm already on step two. I think that tomorrow they're going to make it one step. Uh, I, that's what I think that they're going to do. Co clearly, that's kind of what they're implying here. Uh, but we will check back, check back in on this tomorrow. Um, they already have a five-day withdrawal policy. I'm hoping that they change that to, you know, one-day withdrawals. Here's what I will say. They're trying to tell you that like the express funded account and the live prop account are like, you know, really trading trading their capital, right? But they're locking up that money behind five days. Now Apex is lock, lock, locking it up behind 10. So what I would say is that most likely, if I were their regulatory advisor, I would say that not enough people are passing this, not enough people are actually making money from this, and from a legal perspective, I would say that would be concerning. From a regulatory perspective, I would say that only 22% passing, you probably need to bring that statistic up. Like you need to make it, change the model to where more people are passing. Uh, now everybody knows that, the, you know, that regardless of what the company says, the markets aren't getting easier. Day trading is hard. I don't, guys, day trading, hard. <laughs> hard. It's difficult. It's complex. It's difficult. It's work. It's a challenge. It's a puzzle. It's zagatka, друзья. Schwierig, meine Freunde. Was kann ich sehen? It's difficult. Anybody, listen, anybody who tells you that day trading is easy, it's not. Uh, it's fun. It's a challenging, it's a challenging work environment. It's a puzzle. Uh, if you like puzzles, it's going to test your spatial reasoning. It's going to test your ability to anticipate how things are going to look in the future. It's going to test your logical reasoning. Like, if it does this, then it's probably doing that. And you need to, like, think. That being said, we're going to strip all, the, strip all that away. If I were advising Top Step from a legal standpoint, I would say that 22% pass rate is concerning. Uh, if I were advising them from a business standpoint, I would say... If other companies are coming out and allowing same-day withdrawals, if other companies are coming out and it's only one step to get passed, they're not making, you know, simplifying the passing process to get you to get you funded. Top Step has to keep up with that, has to keep up with what the industry is doing, and so I would imagine that they're probably going to roll out single step. They're probably maybe they make it one day withdrawals instead of five. I would like to see that. Uh, they they need to make it easier for people to get funded. Uh, I think from a regulatory perspective, because, you know, if they can go, if, if, if the regulatory scrutiny that I think is coming, okay, that's from my legal perspective. If the regulatory scrutiny is coming, their best argument 
if I were writing a brief in favor of Top Step from against re- being regulated, uh, I would have to. You would start with, well, you can see that people are actually getting passed. Like here's our pass rate. If your argument is only 22 percent are passing, that's not a good argument. That would not. It'd be a pretty. Uh, that wouldn't be a good argument to stand on. Now, if you can say that 30 percent, 35 percent are getting passed in a very difficult industry, that's a better argument. So they need to bring their pass rates up. I think. They know that regulation is coming. Uh, it is coming. It's a, it's a cloud over the industry for sure. There's no doubt in my mind about that. Uh, regulators are pretty predictable. So 22% pass rate is too low. Uh, I would say that their better argument if they ever got in a court case would have to be you know 30%, 35% passing, at least one-third. Uh, one half trying it and passing would be better, but that's probably unrealistic for how difficult day trading is. So I would say they need to bring the pass rates up to like one third. Um, other than that, you know, from a business perspective, other companies are offering one step. Apex is one step. Now it's a longer fucking step. I don't know what to tell you. It is. It's longer, but it's one step. And then, uh, you know, top step is lagged a little bit behind that. So we will see tomorrow. Um, if they come out, I'll tell you the announcement uh, for Top Step. I will tell you what they're saying, uh, how things are changing. Hopefully it's, you know, good changes. Hopefully it's more client, you know, client-friendly changes, customer-friendly changes. And so with that, we'll be back. Uh, I'll be back with more stuff tonight. Bye.